Knee pain is a common condition I see in my Chinese medicine and acupuncture clinic. And whether that be caused by arthritis, by injury, by wear and tear of cartilage, it can be a debilitating condition for many people. So what I'm going to do in the video today is explain to you how you can use Qigong to help to relieve knee pain, improve flexibility around that joint so that you can go about your day-to-day -day activities. My name is Janice Tucker and I'm a practitioner of traditional Chinese medicine and medical Qigong. I'm also the founder of the Space to Relax online program of Qigong video lessons. And just before we get started, if you'd like to head over to YouTube or if you're watching this on YouTube, give it a like and subscribe by hitting the red button and that way you won't miss any future health enhancing Qigong tips from me. So what are the consequences of having knee pain and having to put up with it? Well, firstly there's the physical aspect to that which obviously causes a restriction and cause, can cause you pain as well. But that physical restriction can also have an emotional impact on you because what often happens is it stops us living our day-to-day -day lives. It stops us from getting joy out of activities that we would normally be able to do. So for example, people may find that they're not able to play with their kids or their grandkids. They're not able to go for a lovely walk on the beach or in the forest because the knee pain is restricting them. The other thing that can happen is that because of the pain, it can be very difficult to sleep well at night. It can often keep you awake at night with the consequence that you end up feeling exhausted when you wake up the next morning. So none of these situations are really sustainable or toler tolerable. Nobody would want to have to put up with them, but if they are ongoing, then they can leave you on an emotional level, level feeling really depressed or irritable or even anxious or fearful about whether or not this pain is ever going to go away. So I'm going to show you a clip uh, just coming up shortly of a really simple exercise which will help to relieve knee pain. But also if you're someone with a history of having dodgy knees, then you might want to use it as a preventative exercise to stop knee pain recurring over and over again. So this method is taken from a series of stretches called the e Tai stretches, which is in my Space to Relax paid membership program of Qigong Video Lessons. And I'm just going to show you the clip of that part of the e Tai stretches to do with the knees. So I'll just cut to that now and show you that if you want to stand up and follow along even better and see how that works for you. But I would say if you've got knees that are painful right now, be very careful, don't go beyond your limit and if you feel any pain, just stop. So here's that clip now. Next for your knees, hands going onto your knees. And again, as with the shoulders, what's happening with this joint is you're thinking from deep within the joint outwards. So really trying to open up the channels of chi flow and get, the, get everything flowing through the knee joint area. So circling them in one direction. So mind is in the knees and just breathing normally. And then change direction. and then circling backwards, out and forwards. So keeping the mind in the knee joints as you do these movements, combining it with the breath, changing direction. Again, taking care if you have any knee problems to be very easy on your knees with this. And then sitting down, keeping the heels on the ground. So with this you can also be thinking not only of the knees but of sending chi down and through the legs as you sit. And then breathing in, come up, sit down, breathe out. Coming up, breathe in, sit down, sending chi down into the feet and then coming back up. So hopefully you found that useful and if you do something like that every day, just gently, that will really help you to improve the flexibility in your knee joints and also relieve any pain. 
The second method, which can be very useful for knees, is one that I have shown in a previous video that I made, and that is just the simple Qigong stance. So I'll put the link to that video in the text below this one or next to this one, and you'll see how to do a perfect Qigong stance, which will really take the pressure off your knees and really help to strengthen the whole of the leg area as well you'll see that once you change your posture and adopt the correct posture, this will promote the free flow of energy, of blood and of fluid through the knee joint area. And once the knees are energized and nourished, then that takes the pressure off them and they tend to be much more loose and much more flexible. And if you're suffering with pain, then that tends to be less over a period of time. So it's well worth practicing just the simple Qigong stance to really help out if you have any knee issues. So if you enjoyed practicing those two simple methods, the extract from the Itai stretches and the simple Qigong stance, then what can you do next in order to take things a little bit further? The first thing you can do is head over to my homepage, which is spacetorelax.com, and there you'll see that you can sign up for a free three-part Qigong video series, which will be delivered to your email over the course of around a week. And at the end of that video series, you can also see that I'll give you the option to join my Space to Relax online program of paid video lessons. So that's a 50 lesson membership program where you get one lesson delivered each week to your email or you and you can log into the website and follow along with those lessons and as you accumulate more and more lessons you have more and more to choose from in your video library and I guide you step by step through the Qigong video lessons. You have full support from me in a Facebook group or by email if you prefer and so you can ask any questions you need to and I would encourage you to do that if you're somebody who really wants to take your practice a little bit further and develop a whole comprehensive healthcare system for yourself because it really gives you the tools to be able to do all the Qigong that you need to do on your own in the comfort of your own home whenever you want to. The second thing you can do is don't forget if you're watching this video on YouTube and if you're not head over there hit the red subscribe button to subscribe for my, to my YouTube channel and then you won't miss any future free Qigong videos from me. And the third thing you can do if you're on Facebook is head over to my free group, which is called Space to Relax Free Qigong Group. And there you can just ask to join. I'll click the button just to let you in. And then you can ask any questions you want to about Qigong. And you'll see also in that group, I'm in there most days. I post regular articles that I come across, which are related to Qigong, to meditation, relaxation and breathing. So you can ask anything you want in that group. There's a lovely community of oh, probably about one and a half thousand people already. Um, so it's a really supportive community of like-minded people. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, then give it a like and please leave me a comment to let me know what you thought of it. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye for now.